Hey, I'm Wurzel and I want to show you today how to create your own uh, player VIP add-on for a bucket server or spy god. So, first of all, um, you need to download a uh, bucket jar, like for any other plugins, and also you need a um, player VIP. So I will show it today for player VIP version 3, uh, not version 2, and yes, uh, version 1 has no RPE, so you can only develop plugins or add-ons for player VIP only for version 2 and version 3. And yes, version 2 is not a very good APE, they are very outdated in every version. So the best RPE is if you are using player VIP version 3. And yes, I will download the latest version of player VIP. So yes. So and now we can create a new project like any other plugin. So um, yes, I will named it as um, a premium join it's a english version now for the same plugin i created already yesterday in german so i don't want to create a main class i will create them self and yes so we can create this project and we need a plugin file so yes, it's like any other normal bucket plugin. So yes, um, the name is um, Premium Join. This plugin uh, will allow um, only um, your VIP player to join your server. So this is allowed through the change of the new rules from Mojang. So you can create a um, special server only for VIPs. This is not forbidden. So and for this server, you can use this so that only um, players who bought a VIP or premium rank on your server um, to join this. So I will create the plugin file. Uh, main um, premium join point premium join and uh, I think I have our ah, version and important for this for this um, add-on is to say depends on player VIP uh, the version number is not required, only the plugin name, so only player VIP and we need don't more, no commands, no permissions or something else. So also I want to add the bucket jar and the player VIP jar, it's the same step like you every time um, add the bucket jar, if you use Eclipse it's the same step and also add to the bucket jar with the same steps um, the player VIP jar and yes okay so now we can create the package uh, not player VIP um, premium join so and we need our main class for the plugin So, delete the comments and plugin is extends from a Java plugin and also implements the listener because um, it only handles events. So, I don't need to create a new listener for a better view for, of code. So, OK, 
okay, we don't want to import. Currently. Why? Okay, um, but we need um, to our two normal methods. It's like another add-on is like any other normal plugin. It only uses um, the API from Player VIP. Uh, oh, I forgot void. Public void and public void on disable. So we don't need commands, so we don't need the on command method. And yes, no, we need the event handler and public void on login and the player login event. So um, yeah, event. And I don't know why NetBeans don't want to import them. What is if I try to build them? Yeah, I know the code is missing, but uh, try to reopen the file. Nothing. Okay, so um, I will import the files from yesterday, the import lines. Um, premium join uh, here. So edit and I will copy the lines and paste them here. more we don't need so now i can um yeah get the player uuid because um i use the uuid version of player vip if you use the name version you can get the player name who tries to join your server um, but in this case um, it's a uuid version for player vip so i need the uuid from the player so it's a player UUID from event point point um, get player point get unique ID and now uh, we can first or we can now um, access the player VIP RPE. This is not very hard. So if um, yes and player vip manager is for the main rpe and now you can see all methods you can use um, for player vip um, this vip will check if the player is um is vip and that will i check with the player uuid and if he is not player uh, he is not a VIP or has any rank sen uh, set with player VIP, so he will automatically disconnect it from server. So event disallow. As results, um, we use kick other, and uh, text he will uh, the client will display why he is disconnected, and I will say he will show the text or display the text. Uh, you must be a VIP to join this server. Um, you can modify this message if you want <coughs> in code. Um, I have also already uploaded um, this plugin from yesterday. So you can <coughs> uh, download this from this page. I already <coughs> I also have the link in the video description. Yes, and now if a player tries to join the server, 
the event is disallowed and will automatically kick the player and displays this message for the kicked player. Uh, only the kicked player sees this message, no one else. And we also need to register the event. So sys.getserver.getplugin.manager.registerevents and this, this. So it's all we need, um, yes, to kick a player who is not, who is not um, VIP or any other ranks uh, set with player VIP manager. Um, there are different other methods you can use. Uh, for example, um, you can check all players for their status um, of his rank or check a special player. Um, generate a new key with the own format or delete an existing key from the database or get all groups from a player in player VIP or get the expire date or expire time, um, the reset group, the used key, uh, get all unused keys or yes, um, push the membership or, or push all memberships uh, set by player VIP. Um, gives the players a reward for the special group. Um, yes, um, save a new key because uh, generate, generate key don't save the key in the database. So you have to generate a key and then you can save the key or also can directly um, create a key hard coded uh, that is um, saved with this method. Or yes, I think a sync player is not functional at the moment or is a little bit buggy. So yes, so, so you can create your own uh, plugins with a player VIP manager. It's a official RPE for player VIP, but you can also try with dirty methods to um, to connect to the database with other methods or um, read strings from the language file and send it to the player but I don't want to tell it now because it can be deprecated and changed every version and player VIP manager don't change every version only from uh, from the name update to the user ID so if you have um, a name version, you use uh, instead of the user ID, you used um, the the player name by event.getplayer.getName, and this will return a string, and that you can use if you don't use a user ID version. So I hope you like this video, and yeah.